welcome to my channel I'm gonna try to zoom zoom through this really quickly I have a Whole Foods haul shopping trip food stuff supplements and etc so we're gonna get in and try to get out as fast as possible it's two trips one from yesterday big one today here we go here we go here we go first thing we got is some um, Dr. Bronner soap is on sale I don't know for how long but I picked up um, this one is almond <clears throat> Smells just like marzipan. If you're familiar with the Lush Christmas soap, it smells like this. It's my favorite. Dr. Bronner's Peppermint. So I grabbed two of those. I've already cracked one open from yesterday. They're toothpaste. I think the whole Dr. Bronner's line or maybe select items is on sale. And if you have Prime, you get that extra little percentage off. Anyways, this is their Dr. Bronner's Peppermint. Um, all-in-one toothpaste. I will do a review on this um, in conjunction with a Glow Collaborative video. So you'll hear my thoughts on this toothpaste inside of a Glow Collab video. Next thing I have here is a one-time sample size or travel size packet of uh, Garden of Life sport in their sport line. And this is pretty much a pre-workout. It's energy and focus. They had two different flavors. The one that I ended up buying is the sugar-free blackberry and cherry. So I'll be using that probably tomorrow because I have two workouts to do and combine it. So hopefully it'll give me a nice healthy little pep without me feeling like a racehorse. Next thing we have here is some um, Alden's Organic Oregon Oregon Made Vanilla Bean Ice Cream. Mm -hmm. It's Bobby approved. Um, I did get myself a treat since I made it to 28 days, 28 to 30 days. I have to look on my calendar of no sweets, no sugars and, and um, treats and stuff like that. So since I had hit that mark, I got myself a cake pop. And this is in vanilla. They did have a chocolate, but I went with vanilla. Let's see. Next thing we have here is Choice Foods or Orange Balsamic. And this is a dressing and a marinade. Canola and soy uh, free. And one of these I bought, I think it's Whole30 approved for those who is participating in that. Um, the, a lot of stuff I picked up today was on sale, so... Um, this is some Thai chili, red chili paste. This was like a dollar and sixty nine cent and a little extra percentage off. Um, Bragg's kelp seasoning was on sale. Almost two dollars off per bottle. So I got one in the kelp and then I got the kind of like the original. I picked up a shot. Uh, Vital Protein Sleep Collagen Shot. This is in the flavor Blueberry Lavender. It's a dairy supplement. And based on just kind of reading it in the store, I think you would consume this entire thing because somewhere I read that you're to drink the whole thing once you opened it. Um, obviously, you wouldn't operate motor vehicles and handle big little infants and stuff after you would consume something that's to make you go to sleep. And then this is the back in case you want to see the rest of what it would do but I like the camera don't want to focus so we're going to keep it moving um, the store my store was very kind and allowed me to sample this size was approved to take home to sample um, because this is a locally produced in Key West Florida um, manufacturer um, of bees honey raw honey and I needed some new honey and the whole line was on sale in different shapes and sizes, different types of honey strands. And um, I was curious. So this one, they marked it off so that I wasn't charged. I got to double check my receipt to make sure I wasn't. And um, I tasted it in store. My daughter went to the little hot area and I like it. And I did pick up another one that will come up in a minute. I got another one of the Thai kitchens, but this one is green chili paste. Yeah, I intend to shake things up. You know, each month I'll try to buy different seasonings, different spices, and different fishes and things. And um, just experiment as I go through this journey and try different recipes to keep things interesting. This was on sale by 50%. 
So normally where these little bad boys like to be $14.99 to $15.99 depending on the marketplace, they were $7.99 or $8.99 today. So I got an English toffee. And I picked up a vanilla cream. And it's to have approximately 288 servings. So I should be good to go and hopefully don't need to replace it before November, December. The supplements are on sale currently. Um, it started today. This is August the 2nd. It says 25% off all supplements. And you get that, if you're prime, that extra, I think like 10%. So it makes things 35. I prefer the bigger guy, but the bigger guy was only available in chocolate, and I've never had the chocolate, and I don't know if I would like it, but I do know I like the vanilla. So I had to go with the little guy and just be happy with it. Plus, my pocketbook is more happy with me doing that as well. You know, trying to go this route, bro, is really like giving me freaking anxiety. I'm so tired. I'm so tired already, but I just got to keep going because internally, I feel better if physically I'm beginning to look better, um, despite, you know. Like. <laughs> but anyways, you know what I'm saying? I really do feel a whole hell of, you know, I don't feel like I'm walking on one ankle. I'm feeling a whole lot better. So um, another thing I picked up is from Dr. Axe. He has a YouTube channel here. You guys can check him out on YouTube. And I picked up his nighttime peptide, collagen peptide. And for those who want to know, I want to say this is... Um, collagen one and three but give me one second this one has five types of food source collagen specifically designed to provide your body with the building blocks it needs for promoting restful sleep and a calm relaxed state of mind helping to alleviate the effects of stress and tension supporting skin hydration and elasticity supporting healthy aging by repairing skin and improving wrinkle deaths come on now. who don't want the wrinkles you know t -t 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 -t. you know what i mean so this has 20 servings in this container and this is for joint and skin so know the difference learn the difference between the collagens because collagen one two and three come from different sources one is like fish and marine one is for cows one is for chickens and they all deal with different things in the the body stretch Get to stretch that knowledge. Okay, next thing we got is superfood, super, sun food, superfoods. Now these are sometimes in Whole Foods and TJ Maxx. So keep your eye out for it if you do like this brand. This is all the good things that it is. You feel me? It's organic. It's non GMO. It's vegan, gluten free, and kosher. Now I went with this blend. I was really debating because this. How you pronounce it, Magnesia? Maki. Maki. Maki is over in another country. I don't remember the country at the top of my head. I want to say like, um, we're just going to leave it alone. But I want to say the Mayans or somebody, but it's somewhere like that. And um, it is known to just do all these amazing things. And one of them is burn fat. Hey, did somebody call me? So anyways, that's why I was very interested in it. But one of the places that I trust who sells it, it sells for 50 and so when I seen it today in this blend of acai, maki, blueberry, red maca, chia, lucumin, lucuma, excuse me, and banana, it was $15.99. Mm -hmm. So I went on ahead and, and picked this up. It's only 11 servings, but it'll get, I know I like all the other things. I've used the other things. This, I don't know if, you know, if I notice any amazing di difference in the Maki, obviously sourced from different places, but Maki, Maki. Next thing I got is some um, Alpen um, Musala. I don't know, man. Right on to the people. And this is some no sugar added traditional blends of grains, fruits, and nuts. Non-GMO verified. You know, that project of people who check on stuff and make sure things is truly what it said it is. And I got this to be basically um, a topper for those yogurts that can't be flavored and all of that so a little drizzle of that honey a little sprinkle dinkle of this a little boom some fruit and hey let's go um i got some ezekiel bread long live ezekiel <laughs> i'm sorry so it's been a long time it's been some years 
sis, I had Ezekiel in my house, and um, it's a tough bread. You know, you need to get your dentures and your teeth, you know, ready to roll. But it's a healthy bread. It's a bread and a grain that is really good for you. Let me pull it up a little closer. You know, my seven day Adventist people, you know about that Ezekiel, don't you? Gotta talk about that in service. Now, let's go. Next thing is some, um, um, what is this? Viola Life, Viola Life, 100% vegan. This is some feta cheese in a block form because you know, block less of synthetics and all that filler bull crap. And you shave your own thing and have my own graders and you shave your things up. The more you do yourself, the healthier it is a lot of times. We got some good old fashioned blueberries, blackberry, blackberry, get it right blackberry blackberries are one of the top tier fruits I have my if you can see here this is what I reference I do a video based on this because you know some of y'all might need some baby steps on this but anyhow blackberries is number three second uh, under right under uh, blueberries what is this what is this oh you know I really went on a quest to you know ever been in the store and it's like you know what I'm a smidge it over budget. What the hell? I might as well just get that one other thing. Over is over. So add a little extra inch of dirt right on that six feet and just call it a day, right? So I went on ahead and I bought myself this soap from this company. I don't even want to butcher the name. What? Pacha? Pacha soap? What's up, Pacha? This is Rainforest Alliance certified palm oil. Um, it's got none of those silicones and parabens and phthalates. It's handmade with some love. I hope so. And, um, you know, they make bear, uh, bath bombs and bar soaps. And so I picked up this one. Isn't this the most psychedelic, beautiful, you know, Mexican hut looking thing I've ever seen in my life? It just makes me think, yeah, what is those, those little houses? The little dome. God, and they be out in the deserts, like people in Arizona would have some of those houses. That's what I think about when I see these, this color scheme. But it smells so sweet and so fruity. And I hope I come out smelling so fresh and so clean, clean. All right, next thing we got is Organic Girl. I stand by this, bro. If something ever go down with this cup, I'm going to be out there with my picket fence. Their <laughs> lettuce just really, um, it lasts. I mean, when I meal prep, something you want to switch it up. You don't want to eat the same thing every day, and then you be like this on your, you know, on your wellness kick. So um, sometimes, you know, I might only eat it a couple of times out of the week because I'm trying to rotate and move things around. Long story short, this in my personal refrigerator can live and be fresh before it's like, okay, bro, I've done what I came to do for almost three weeks, all day. All day long. I also, and they have so many different varieties and versions. I saw I have a little guy here of Organic Girl. And this is the Super Spanish. So this one has baby spinach, baby bok choy, and sweet baby kale in it. So, you know, you're getting that, that vitamin A, that vitamin C, that vitamin K, folate, magnesia, um, some beta carotene. It's going to give you some potassium and some magnesium, something that this twitchy muscle lady we need. Um, I'm not cooking at 10.28 tonight, so I picked up one of their chickens. Now, their rotisserie chicken the last time that I picked up last month was, it was tough. <laughs> it was dry and tough, and it was flavorless. So, this one looks like it's got a little bit more juices flowing through it, and I'm going to show you one of the sauces here from, that I showed you earlier, drizzle it over. I'm going to hit it with a little extra seasoning, put it in the oven for about 10 minutes, and see if I can help it just give it a little bit of kick. And then I got things just produce. So we got some green onions. We just got some limes. Let's see here. Parmesan cheese from Viola or Viola Life. 100% vegan. Let me say share this much about it. It is dairy free, soy free, gluten free, low to low lactose, nuts, and preservative free. And when I bought their aged cheddar last month, oh man, bro, 
I was like, ooh. Delicious. Uh, I got some carrots. I got a different size because I love shredded carrots. But I got these so that I can do some roasting and baking and stuff. I have here two yams. Another, um, I want to roast and bake with a um, golden a golden um, beet. So I want to cut up the beet with the yams and um, something else, drizzle it, put a little bit of stuff, and it'll be like a dessert for me, actually. That's how I've been manipulating, you know, stuff like that. Cucumber. Oh, I'm trying to move as fast as I can, guys. We have tilapia. We got some Key West shrimp. Already clean, peeled, deveined, and all that. We have some wild caught cod. Now, cod tends to be can be run a little dry, so I'll probably do almost like a water bath and steam it with um, the broth of be the vapor, you know, the what have you and whatnot. So just help it out and keep it from, you know, being tough as nails. Got some portobello mushrooms, some lemons. Uh, I got some more fresh uh, ginger root. And then this one here is a turmeric root. Zest it down, guys. My favorite guys in the world. Blood purifier. Blood builder. So many things beets do for you. So I got some beets. The regular beets. So it'll be like a, a almost like a vegetable medley type of dish. I may record myself doing it or like maybe the tail end. Maybe I'll do something like a minute of what it looks like going into the oven and maybe a minute of it coming out and shoot that for you guys. Don't know about to steal my crap and don't even give enough credit for it because I've been saying a lot of that. I just I just don't throw that out there. If I borrow an idea, I'll tell you guys. Hey, I got this from such and such and such. This is some Whole Foods um, cut organic chicken wings. And it was like $7.05. Let me see, we got some, some broccoli, had a broccoli, a bunch of collard greens, so I'm going to go over to Publix probably tomorrow and grab a couple of either turkey necks or neck bones, clearly turkey necks is better than neck bones, but really, so, and I just got a little small bunch because it's just me here right now, so yeah man, and me, oh, that's an older kid that just keep making vocal cameos. <laughs> All right, I got some um, red potatoes. I got some baking going on in my pretty much like pot roast. And I got jalapeno because I intend on doing a little taco something at this some point tonight. I mean, not tonight. Hell no, not tonight. Okay, I had ran out of space, but I grabbed some more. So we back. We're going to continue this. Another head of um, broccoli. The girl like broccoli. I like my greens though, Oh, girl. no. Oh, let me show you. I got this from the Whole Free. You know how I got this for free? Because, was it Love With Food? Love With Food sent a coupon. So, yeah, let's test this out. Because, let's see, if I open it, will it at least stay fine through the night and I can finish it in the morning? Oh. Oh, and it has iconic... Protein drink, 20 grams of protein, 3 sugars, and 130 calories, 4 grams of fiber. And then it's all this good stuff down here, down below. And um, I picked vanilla bean. They had a ton of different flavors. So coffee lovers, they had a mocha and stuff like that. And um, I went with this. So let's see what this tastes like. I want to say I've had this before. I just don't remember if I digged it or not. It tastes thin. It tastes thin. It don't have like a nice thick milk texture. It tastes more plant based, but it's got grass fed milk, protein, isolate, blue agave. Anyways, you know, chicory root. It's not bad. It's got like this little sugary 
sweetened taste going over, but it's, it's not terrible. Oh my goodness. Electrolyte water, avocado ranch, tested maize. I really been digging that chipotle one that I got last month. I'll show it. Strawberries. Some strawberries here. We're trying to get stuff put away too. Um, I got another ripple. And this one is the unsweetened vanilla. What I got from last night. Hold on, let me show you guys that real quick. Do you really want to make me cry? I can't watch it in my camera. Alright, so I got a coconut um, by Calfe Farms. Go coconuts, coconut milk, and a coconut water blend. And um, what is this? For a ranger? I don't know, you guys. I don't. You know, I start making faces when I can't pronounce. I don't know. But, anyways, this is blueberry. And this is another unsweet. And if you're wondering, like, what the hell? You got a lot of milks. Well, one, I don't like yeah. to go to back and forth to the grocery store. So. I have a good bit to try to get me through at least a solid, stop it, 14 days um, of cooking. Plus, when you start using these in protein powders, like I showed you earlier in supplements, they go very quickly. They go faster than you realize. So, I think I have one more bag, which I'm pulling it up. Oh, no. Um, oh, no, she's eating the... Let me hurry up. I mean, my God. Okay, so then we have Ezekiel um, 4.9. So pretty much scripture 4.9. 4.9. Reference that in your Holy Bible if you own one. And read up on Ezekiel. I got, um, but anyways, that is some um, sprouted grain burger buns. So I think what I'm going to do is divide the bag in half. Half will be treated for like chicken burgers and things like that. But the other half, I intend to use one half of a half to one half of a whole. Oh, God. Not Because a, a half of a half will be a quarter. So, no, we're not doing that. But we're doing a half of a bun, you know, pair. And I think it would be great for um, omelets and, you know, um, those egg custards, like what you make baking the um, muffin tin and stuff like that or frying some bacon and making your own like egg mint muffin but to cut the portion of instead of doing both buns just use one half then I got some more still coat cut oatmeal I got myself a good culture cottage cheese because I wasn't sure if I would like this brand's own but I wanted to give it a try so I just grabbed one it was on sale for $1.69 plus my little 10% off um, got some daisy sour cream because again I'm trying to work get some ingredients in here for tacos um, I got myself some bananas holy god I got ciate I think this is Manisi how long are you the Spanish person ciate ciate bro yeah. it's a number in Spanish I love I'm not I make noises. So I'm not offending nobody. I come, from, you know, my people come from somewhere else. So you know what I'm saying? We all, we all. And this is some hibernara hot sauce. So yeah, don't take offense to that. I make noises for all kinds of things. So please don't. Um, baking powder. Because I want to make a banana cake thingamajig. I was telling Christy about it. Um, taste of Home. It's a Taste of Home recipe. I've already printed it out. But it didn't have baking soda and baking powder. And it's a banana frost frost cake type of thing. It's baking soda. I need it some fresh. Yeah, I'm fine. I'm playing shrimp <laughs> um, Some bean trio. Because, you know, your, your girl needs some chili. I do like chili. I don't cook seasonally. I cook what I want when I want to. Because I heard somebody talking about that. There's no rules, guys. Come on now. Get out of the box. Um, Dijon mustard. Whole Foods 360 organic. Traditional whole mustard. I mean, Dijon mustard. Let's see what I have. I love these. I always pick up a can or two. This is some Goya pigeon peas. I'm almost there, guys. I'm trying. Um... I got some Cafe Farms oat oatmeal. Ooh, 
Lord Jesus, I finally found it. When I saw this, Bobby was covering oils and stuff. This is some algae oil. And this can cook at a high um, temperature point. So this would be great for sautéing and things like that. And this is a cousin to um, avocado. If you like avocado, it's a good monosaturated fat, guys. And this is from Thrive Culinary Algae Oil. So I'm very, very excited to cook with it and give it a try. I'm, I'm just sighing and stuff. I'm so sorry. I got the Keys Bees Florida Keys Raw Honey straight from the comb. And this is a different one. So see the texture on this one? And this one was, what is this, Lachi? Leche. Leche, that's right. Huh. Leche. 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 That's right. And so you see it's a little different. And they had another one that was even darker, like dark molasses. So I went with this one. Now this one I paid for because the size of it was too big. So the lady said that I could, this one couldn't be marked off where I can take it home to sample it for free. So, you know, I know a lot of times Whole Food really is whole check <laughs> type of, you know, it's got that, that what you call it. Um, I'm sorry guys, it's late and I'm running out of steam, so I get a little bit of brain fart, but, um, it has that little thing that they are expensive, but sometimes they, they have built in those type of things where if you're well, not extra sure, services extra services and features, and I was thinking the whole fool's hold paycheck, that little stigma that's associated with the store and yes yeah, god it's all the news articles and different documentaries but anyways if you want to try something they do have that same feature similar to trader joe's where they will open certain products up for you and you can try it out in the store for free and they do have an excellent return policy i was even assured that if i you know take this one home open it and i don't like it to just bring it back to them and they will honor the refunds. So, sometimes just ask. This is going in a giveaway, so this is not for me. This is for one of you. And some of that back hey, there is for awesome one of you. Viewers. One of you awesome mofos. Somebody, you take their vital proteins and go to sleep. Anyways, I got uh, some Moringa. Kulu, Kulu. Uh, Moringa Green Energy. This one's in Coconut Lime. I promise you guys, this bag is like the Mary Poppins <gasps> carpet bag, bruh. I'm telling you. Then I got the Kula Kula, and I actually was following them for years on Instagram, and I think I recently unfollowed, so I need to refollow. Who does this? Just, I'm going to always tie true. So I'm just, it's just a button. Push the button. Um, because I really do like what they stand for. They stand for some good stuff. Ethical stuff, bro. They on all over it. And I got raspberry. And then I got one from my daughter for in the morning. And she picked the flavor ginger, ginger lime, guys. Guess what I did for the very first time and I feel like a hero. I did my own nut butter. So, yeah, they got a little machine always been walking right past it. I swear to God, I gotta stop that. When I go into sort of hyper focus and don't look to the left or the right. So the day I seen it, and so they have different size containers, and I went with this size to give it a try. And I got some fresh organic. You can get non-organic or organic. And they also had a honey roasted peanut butter. Um, and they had a nut uh, organic peanuts that you could make your different butter. So I went with organic. Um, nut butter, almond butter. Wait, so this, this is also for the giveaway, and you'll see once it's pulled together why there is a little mug cake mix with an icing. And I thought this was totally cool because it's prepackaged. The directions is on there. It's easy, breezy, and all that jazz. And then I got myself a little maple syrup. This is eight ounces. And this is a Butternut Mountain Farm from Vermont. Um, grade A, dark color, and robust taste. Yeah, let's do that robust taste. I think the bag is finally empty. And then we just got some last bits and bobs back here. So I went with this cake, Vanilla Cake Slice. I had this almost two months ago. 
about two, two and a half months ago, and I, and I shared it with my son, and I really enjoyed it. And then it looked like this is my lunch or something tomorrow, but I went with the turkey and cheese. Just in case you didn't know, they do make different little pre-made lunchable type things, and these are for $4.99. And I went with turkey and cheese, and my daughter had a, um, <laughs> it's gone, y'all. I had chicken and cheddar. Chicken and cheddar. So, I think, um. That's so sad. Yeah, yesterday I had got a pizza, and what else, kid? Oh, two coconut waters. I've been drunk those, and, um. Yeah, like some cookies. I bought some cooked uh, the bakery ones. So a bakery two uh, cookies or so for my daughter and a cookie for myself. And then I ended up donating mine because it was sweet. That's it, everybody. I'm pretty sure I'm going to click this button and then look around and be like, oh, damn, I didn't share that with them. Oh, well. Y'all got the gist of it. This is what you do. This is where, you, you know, the direction you go in if you're trying to you know, take those steps towards improving your health. I appreciate your time. I appreciate your viewership. And please no one be offended. I make little noises and things when I can't pronounce certain words. And that's just like me inserting a little added commentary. But don't be offended. I come from a multi, multi ethnicity and cultured family. Um, I need to start learning some other languages because it don't make no sense. Um, but trust me, I'm the furthest thing from having a race issue. God bless you. See you in the next video. Peace.